All right, everybody, we're getting in the CTS V right now with Paul. Let's see what it's all about. Finally getting a chance to hop in this car. Oh, yeah. Man, y'all, I told y'all it's gonna be a good vlog today, so thanks for watching. Paul, while I'm doing this, tell everybody how much power, what we got done? Uh, it's just photons. I don't know what okay. kind of power it makes. It'll be, uh... You gotta dyno it. I do have to dyno it. Yeah. I don't know if I'm gonna dyno it. Uh. I'm shooting for nines. A 9.99, uh -huh. will do. Still shooting for nines. Wow. I mean, already a super fast car to begin with, right from the dealership. Uh, engine leader, of course, it's a V8. I mean, some of y'all watching already know all the facts of the CTS V. So let's just sit back, relax, and enjoy the ride. Relax is probably a bad word. <laughs> yeah, let's not relax. <laughs> Trying to get this thing finished up. I want to put it on some E85 before, uh, mm -hmm. before long. I was going to take it up to Charlotte for the streetcar takeover, but... Huh. Just the rain is supposed to be bad up there, and I'm yeah. probably gonna get caught off. So we're so on, it sits uh, pretty low to the ground. Yeah, we're on MNH Race Masters. They're down to 16 psi. I'll go ahead and heat them up real quick. Yeah, that's tight. Yeah, we just <laughs> left black marks. Wow. Okay, next time put the camera on me so y'all can see my reaction to that. Just, uh, Man, that puts you back, doesn't it? Yeah, it, it moves. Wow. It does. Should make another, almost another 100 horsepower on E85, hopefully. Oh, no. another 100 horsepower on what? I gotta get a fuel pump first, but uh -huh. should make about another 100 horsepower on E85. E85 um, ethanol? Yep. It's gonna give it some timing and um, hope a little bit of nitrous uh -huh. until I destroy the trans and then we'll do something with that. But. So, you're the first I've heard E85. Well, what do you mean? I mean, the ethanol. Yep, you're telling me uh, that fa makes it faster. Yeah, 85% um, the alcohol content in it, hopefully. Okay. And um, you can get a lot more timing out of it. It comes out to like 105 octane or something like that. Uh-huh. Um, so it's essentially cheap race gas. It smells like corn. <laughs> it smells like corn. Man. Right, because most gas stations have E85. Yep, a lot of the stinks around here carry the E85. They've always tested, tested pretty good. Okay. So, good to know. on them to carry it on their end. Now, are there any other CTSVs in Charleston that you know of? There's uh, there's quite a few, and they come out to the Cars and Coffee on Saturday mornings out in Mount Pleasant. Okay. Um, a lot of them have a good bit of work done to them. Uh, I got Brian Solomon, Chad Real, just two guys off the top of my head. Yeah. Real down to earth, always willing to give people a hand with them. I got to come out there one Saturday. It's yeah, it's worth it. I know. I need to. Let's see here. We're gonna turn around here. Real quick cool. That's fine. From the dig. Now, just real wheel drive, correct? Just real wheel right. drive. Right. And this engine is also in Corvettes, right? It is in the supercharged Camaro. The, the, okay. Um, the ZL1 Camaros. So. Now the, the, the vet sitting out there tonight. That has what he engine? Is, um, I think he's a Vengeance built 440. Okay. I don't know if he wants me to give away all of his secrets. I'm with you. Yeah. <laughs> Let me go ahead and heat these tires up real quick. Oh, holy shit! Paul knows how to drive, folks. And, uh, you ready? No, I'm ready. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. It's, wow. Uh, 45 miles an hour. <laughs> Man, that's called pure adrenaline. Man, that's fast. <laughs> and that's fun. Wow, that's what American muscle is all about, everybody. Don't need no type R. That's right. <laughs> and we won't put that on the. That's this is not going on Type R video. <laughs> <laughs> and this is the Charles and Car video vlog tonight. Yeah. Yeah. Now, yeah, the Civic Type R's. It's not doing that kind of stuff. It, it turns. Yeah, it does turn. Yeah, it sure <laughs> does. But um, it's, I'm sure the Type R is going to be a great car to own if you're driving one. But ooh, not the not the CTSV like this. Wow. Well, I think the Type R will make it around the track a lot faster than this thing will. Uh huh. If this even makes it around the track. <laughs> yeah, it's more of a road car, uh, yeah, it's, road race. It's yeah. It's a big fan. Yeah. All right, everybody, I'm cutting off that one, folks. I'm Cut. You ready? All right, hold on. One more. Ready? Yeah. That's fun. Thank you, Paul. Yeah, man. 
course. Awesome. All right, everybody, thumbs up on that. Hell yeah. Cool. All right, we're back. That was, yeah, that was a great ride in the CTSV. Oh boy. <laughs> You know, it's pretty and it's fast. That was cool. Oh yeah. Let's look at the Genesis. Looking pretty good too. I like the Genesis. Slammed, nice wheels. Beautiful body on the Hyundai Genesis. I mean, look how that thing just curves. Looks pretty sweet. I'm liking it. American muscle. Yeah. All right. Look at this one. Z06, looking good. Can the Z06 do what that car just did? I do not know. Yes, it can. Of course. This guy's got a lot done to this as well. All right.